great artists of the 20th century. Thomas Mann, the writer. Lucchino Visconti, the filmmaker. Two artists combined to tell the story of an artist. Dirk Bogard is Aschenbach, the artist at the climax of his career, composer, conductor, maker of great music, suddenly alone. We once had one of those in my father's house. The aperture through which the sound runs is so tiny that at first it seems as if the level in the upper glass to our eyes, it appears that the sand runs out only at the end. And until it does, it's not worth thinking about her. Until the last moment. And there's no more time. Aschenbach, the artist at the crisis of his life. of the senses. It's all gone. Nothing remains. Nothing. 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 Your music is still born. Suddenly alone. Alone in the magical city they say is doomed to sink back into the sea from which, like Venus, it rose. Aschenbach, the artist at the crisis of his life, here faces the images of beauty and mortality. Why are they disinfecting Venice? <laughs> Go away immediately, don't delay. Please, I beg you. Take that sill and your daughters. I implore you, please. Venice is gripped by pestilence. <laughs> The appreciation of this major addition to those few films which join the canon of great art has been expressed by select audiences and critics in England and throughout the continent with the repeated use of one word, masterpiece. <laughs> <laughs>